Hello. So what we got here is, I don't know why my video isn't videoing, but anyway, first we need to figure out how far he is from the top of the tower when he's 80 feet from the base. So use the Pythagorean theorem, 60 squared plus 80 squared equals C squared. We get C is 100. All right, so then we're going to go back to the Pythagorean theorem again. We'll say this one's A and this one's B. And we get the A squared plus B squared equals C squared again. We're going to differentiate that. We get 2 times A dA dt plus 2 times B dB dt equals 2 times C dC dt. Okay. Now, the height of the tower is not going to change, so dA dt is going to be 0. So now we just have 2 times b, which is 80. Well, you know what? Let's do it this way. So we just have 2 dB, or 2b dB dt equals 2c dc dt. Okay, divide both sides by 2, and we'll plug in the numbers that we know. We know that B is 80, and we know that he is walking towards the tower at 5 miles an hour. And that's going to equal C, which is 100, times DC, DT, which is what we're trying to find. Now, what's going to happen the 80 and the 100, the units on those are in feet, but those units are going to cancel out when I divide both sides by 100. Then we'll just be left with the five, with the miles per hour on the five, and that equal what I get when I divide by 100 is going to be in miles per hour. Okay, then when I divide, I get four equals DC DT. And that's gonna be miles per hour. Okay. So he's approaching the top up here at four miles an hour. Thank you.